Hi there, everybody, and welcome to another PowerPoint presentation. In this episode, we're going to be talking about animations, the animations tab. Animations are a lot of fun, but I do want to make sure that I warn all of you, audiences get really tired of the animations, so don't use those on a real constant basis, or you're going to have people really kind of upset with what you're doing. Now, with the animations, we can add some objects to a page, and we can animate we can make them appear like they're coming alive on the screen. You can make them move, you can make them slide in, you can make them slide out, you can make them just appear. There's a lot of options you can do. So let's first start with something that we're going to need to animate. So I'm going to come up to insert and I'm just going to put a text box on the page. And let's do something fancy, like add this as a text box in here. And work. let's make it oh, about this big. That'll work pretty well. Now, with the animations, what you're able to do is come up to the Animations tab. And you'll notice now the objects are appearing. They actually have color, where before they were kind of grayed out. So let's have it fly in you can come over with the effect options and you can change the way it comes on. So let's have it come from the upper left corner in. So from top left. See how that flies in? Then if we click on this box, we can change how long it takes for it to get onto the screen. So let's have it take one second to get onto the screen. And so we'll have that and we have on click it will come on so as soon as we click our mouse you can have it come on with another animation that happens to be on the screen so we have that and so now we have this if we want to check and see how it looks let's just start our PowerPoint and now I'm gonna click and there it comes now this is the part that makes people frustrated because if you have this take too long an audience gets really bored. I would stay away from using very many animations. It, uh, I think you're just going to end up with people not really always happy. But when you're goofing around, I know it's a lot of fun to add these in. Let's add another animation to this screen right here. So I'm just going to add another text box on. This is a different text box. So let's just make that a little larger too and we're going to keep that down underneath here now we come back to our animations tab um, what should we do with this one how about grow and turn and see how that kind of grew and it turned as it came on and we'll say one second again and let's go with this one let's go after the previous so that will come on after this one so let's find out now if all that's gonna work so I'm gonna come in and let's start our PowerPoint and I click on the screen yeah do you see how they came on at two different times that's how you're able to use some of the different um, items as far as how long something's gonna take to get on the screen and when it's going to appear now you can add some other animations going up this way if you would like um, it you can have your entrance effects and, and emphasize effects. That's for you to kind of figure out as you're kind of goofing around with all of this. But it's just kind of a lot of fun. Animations can add to your presentation or they can take away from your presentation. Just kind of use a little bit of common sense and don't go too overboard with them and you'll like them. The best way to learn to use animations is just to goof around and then just keep coming in and practicing with those until you see what they can do. That's how everybody learns it the best. You will too. So that's how you can use the animations tab.